Hey, bud. How's it going? If you're new to the channel, then, uh, hey, my name's Sam. Usually I have a different intro and a different uh, setup in that I have a co-host, Steph, and he's not available right now. So I thought we'd pick something fun, something relatively simple that I know very little about. And obviously that's Rio. I know that it's about a blue macaw, obviously, and uh, I guess it stars Jesse Eisenberg. Now, for those of you who enjoyed the videos with me and Maria, we really appreciate that. And we are still going to be posting some videos together. However, it may be on the Sam and Maria channel. And we'll also, of course, still be posting uh, Buffy videos on our Buff Summer channel. I will leave links to both. And I hope to see you there or here or wherever else. So I assume we're starting out here in actual Rio, like De Janeiro, yeah? So we're just getting to know all the bird wildlife. Any other animals? Okay, so all the birds. I guess that answers that. Uh... <laughs> Is that our little star? And I love the song, but maybe don't teach kids to romance with danger from baby age. Oh shit. Oh, I guess that makes sense. No, learn how to fly. Oh, I guess don't learn how to fly. Well, it's all right, people. He's okay. Relatively speaking. Yeah, definitely not Rio. Oh, Anne Hathaway's in this. Right, I feel like I knew that, but uh, I forgot. Warming his ass. Oh man, I wasn't expecting that. Good times. Standing demanding. Okay. I mean, I guess shitty old trucks. Oh, buddy. It's okay. I mean, it's kind of okay. He must be freezing his ass off. I'll take care of you. Nice. I'm glad it was just some sweet young kid who found him. Wait, so how long do these birds live? And how much time has passed here? Like, what, 10 years? Seven years? Ah, uh. <laughs> uh, sucker. Good morning, Blue. Wait, what have you got to brush? Okay, well, that's fun. Tyler Blue, these vitamins are good for you. <laughs> uh, classic. God damn, this dude's got it made. <laughs> Wait. Oh, okay. So you live above the store that you own. Pretty cool. <sighs> Gonna say it's been more than 10 years though. I'd love to visit, but who would take care of Blue? They don't have kennels for parrots. Yeah, that'd be unfortunate. Here's your hot chocolate, Blue. <laughs> Just anyone. This is the life. Yeah, bud. Perfect marshmallow to cocoa ratio. You do really seem like you've got the sweet life now. Good for you. If it isn't my favorite nerd bird. Where are you migrating to this year? The breakfast nook? <laughs> Is that Jane Lynch? Throw all the snowballs. I'm protected by this magical force field called glass. <laughs> While you guys are out there freezing your... La, 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 la. Um, I don't think they're freezing. Um, what? <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> you good, man? Are you all right? Oh. Uh, face down, ass up. Just perfect. Are you looking for some books? No, <laughs> looking for him. Oh, okay. Doctor of Ornithology. <laughs> well, yeah, that's weird. <laughs> wow. Stop doing that. You're actually communicating. You fucking weirdo. No, he's not. I introduced myself and shook my tail feathers, thus deferring to his dominance. I did not get that at all. Yeah, what? what? Dr. Montero. Oh, you... no. Call me Tulio. Blue is the last male of his kind. Right. Okay. We found a female, and our hope is to save their species. So it's a romance movie. Yeah. When can she come over? No, no. Blue must come to Rio de Janeiro. Who's paying for that? Are you paying for that? Oh, no. No, 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 no. It's all arranged. You will be with him every step of the way. Okay. So you did pay for all of this. Well, that's okay. Blue is very particular. We're not big on travel. He doesn't even fly. But of course he can fly. Uh... Perfect specimen. Their natural instincts take wait, over. Wait, 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 no! <laughs> oh, he really didn't learn how to fly. Almost always. Blue! Oh, that's... Okay. What kind of doctor are you? Not great. Are you okay? Perhaps it's too domesticated. Yeah... You didn't help him learn how to fly, dude? Very nice of you to stop in and throw my bird. It's time for you to go. This could be our last chance. Yeah. Have a safe flight. I mean, hang on. Before we move on to the whole last chance situation, Linda, you've had this bird for, I'm going to say 10 years. We'll say you're more than 10 years. Point is, you've had this bird this long and you never tried to help him fly? He wasn't flying on his own and you were like, nah, it's fine. He doesn't need that. His whole species will be gone. Just think about it. Yeah, think long and hard about it. Although I can guess that she's kind of come to this conclusion pretty quick. Feels like the plot of the movie. I can do this. I have quadrated my vector angles. <sighs> oh shit. So you are a nerd bird. Cool. Flaps open, landing gear, tail flaps. Actually, not bad. How will you know if they're not bad if you've never seen any other birds Let's to compare to? Not to say that you should be comparing yourself <laughs> to other people like that, but you know. Thrust, lift, drag, wait, 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 wait. Ah! Oh, yeah, buddy. Ah! You know what? I feel you there. I get it. Blue? Ah! Not on the flying aspect, but just from skateboarding, you know? You're rolling up to like a stair set and you think you've totally got this. And at the last minute, you're like, no, no I, I don't got this. And hopefully you bail out in time to not get hurt without even trying the trick because that is the worst. <laughs> but yeah, can't say I haven't bitched out of a few roll ups. It happens. I promised I would always look out for you. You did. I wouldn't make you do this if it wasn't the right thing. What do you say, Blue? Seems like maybe a good idea to at least find out. Yeah, there you go, guys. We'll be back home before we even know it. Cute that you have your own handshake. And I wonder what that's like. Has he even come across another macaw? Your turn, Blue. You don't want to get beak burn. Can he get beak burn? Is that a thing? <laughs> uh, good times. What's going on here? Carnaval! It's the biggest party in the world. Time to have fun and dance. Yeah, I appreciate you explaining. She doesn't seem like she knows how to party. Is she a performer? She's my dentist, Dr. Barbosa. Don't forget to floss, Julio. Yeah, he's going to forget, intentionally or otherwise. Come tomorrow night, everyone will be dressed like that. La, 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 Jair, to the ball. Oh, wait. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, Devo. I'm not from here. He's a tourist. Funny, you don't look like one. Hmm. Except you got pigeon doo-doo on your nose. <laughs> <laughs> Are you here for carnival? I'm just here to meet a girl. Oh. Make the first move. Brazilian ladies respond to confidence. I don't know if he has a choice on which moves who's gonna make. Gotta pop out that chest, eyes narrow. This is all very, you know, out of necessity. First, we gotta bust you out. What? Pop that cage open like a soda can. No, that's okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I was thinking for a second that it's like an arranged marriage, but it's not. Because at least in an arranged marriage, it's not about, you know, you're the last surviving member of your race. At least, I'm pretty sure. 
<laughs> this thing's robust. No, 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 guys, really, I'm fine. Shoot yourself. Hey, don't forget, love Hawk. As, and to you as well. Absolutely. Fantastic advice. This is the heart and soul of our aviary. They really like you. Oh, you'd fucking hope so. He spends all his time here. I'm their great big mama bird. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, dude. No. Oh, no. Ew. <laughs> yeah. Mm -mm. Want some? Ah. No, it fucking, are you kidding me, man? You trying to get her to eat out of your mouth? Mm-mm, fuck that. Many of the birds here were rescued are often hurt, but with proper care, they can be saved. Well, I appreciate he's so passionate about the birds. This poor guy was found last night. Hey, buddy, you're looking great today. Much better. Man, how do you look before? Get well soon. <laughs> Where's Jewel? We have a special place for Jewel. She's a very spirited bird. I'll say. Oh. Shit, that's rough. No, no, don't worry. I'm gonna make you look irresistible. Okay, that wasn't his concern. Help! Help! Is that what he's supposed to look like? Ah! Yeah, that's cool. All right. Maybe I should. No, no, give it a chance. Hmm. Hello? Whoa. Pretty fancy looking habitat they've put together here. Hello? <laughs> I come in peace. <laughs> All right. She's beautiful. What were they talking about? She's like an angel. A vicious angel? Who's getting really close up. Oh, yep, there you go. A savage angel. Kick yourself as in Dorky. You're standing on my throat. Oh, you're an American. I need my throat for talking, so thank you. You look like me. So that's Anne Hathaway, yeah, obviously. Seems like. My name is Blue. Come on, we don't have much time. <laughs> Seems a little odd, but whatever. Are you ready? Oh, wow. Uh, okay. <sighs> Crazy love hawk. All right. Oh, God. Whoa. Nope. What? Hi, what are you doing? What? what? What are you doing? I'm trying to escape. Ah, uh, okay. That's where I was going with that thing I just Wait, did. 100%. Did you actually think we were going to kiss? No, no, I think they need a little help. Yeah, I'm sure they need a lot of help. I'm not that kind of bird. Say you. <laughs> that's that's not that's not it. That is not it. I had nothing to do with that. You have to admit it's actually a pretty good song. Naturally. Dude. Sing it, Lionel. <laughs> that was fast. Lionel Rich. Insights violence? Good to know. Keep that on hand. I'm not so sure I should leave Blue here alone. Sylvia will keep an eye on them all night. <laughs> Frightening. <laughs> Yeah, no one's coming to help you, bud. Let's <laughs> nice. Go for it, buddy. I, I hope those were already tear-away clothes. And everyone will rip good clothes. <laughs> uh, I didn't do anything. Come here, poor little birdie. Yeah, I had you. Um, going on here. Oh yeah, there it is. I wandered. Okay, so not sick, just kind of looks like it. Cool. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> Done getting your butt kicked. I am trying to sleep. I'm trying to escape. Why? This cage is awesome. I wouldn't expect a pet to understand. Well, that's rude. I am a companion. Tomorrow morning, Linda will come for me and this whole nightmare will be over. Fair enough, bud. You would rather be with a human than with your own kind. That human has given me love for the past 15 years where- 15 years, useful, there you go. Because of them, I've lost everything. Can't trust them. Of course you can trust humans. It's not really a can or can't, it's just which humans? Oh. Ah. Oh, well, not that one. Apparently. It's nice of you to join me for dinner. I often eat alone because, of course, my work. Sure. Because your work. That's what it is. Do you have a favorite bird? I'm a blue macaw kind of gal. They are very handsome birds. Yeah, I mean, is she a... Actually, it's the brains I'm more attracted to. Is she a bird person in general, or does she just like this one bird? My favorite bird is the spotted owl. Always been mesmerized by those round... <laughs> <laughs> That's a weird little... You know, I know what they're doing, and I'm sure you know what they're doing, obviously. The big round eyes that she's got, but like, 
that's the same traits you find attractive in a woman. The stuff that you are passionate about or interested in with a bird, that's what you want out of a woman. Flambada! Oh, oh, chicken hearts! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, wow, that'll be super irritating. Oh, right, because they were like stolen or whatever. Liberated? I guess it depends on who did it and kind of the same thing either way. We should have never left Moose Lake. This is all my fault. No. Oh, wow. No, obviously it's not your fault. It's at least mostly his fault. This is not your fault. <laughs> You're right. Oh, you're going to realize that too? It's your fault. What? There you go. Nice. <laughs> no, I'm fucking with you guys. It's everyone involved's fault. It's generally how these things go. Don't understand. Sylvia is the best guard in the business. Sorry, what? You were attacked Ooh. by a little white bird. He held it to my mouth like like this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, it's chloroform. Okay, okay. There's no place like home. There's no place. Oh, I miss my little bell. Shh. Do you? Think you're gonna end up back home? I did. If you do the Alice in Wonderland thing, you know? Just do it. <laughs> Stop twitching. Oh, Come God. On. It's the twitching that sells it. A terrible death scene just reminded me of the two most fantastically awesome, the terrible death scenes I've ever seen, both in one movie. It was recently uh, me and Maria did the Buffy movie, like for our Buffy channel. <laughs> and Donald Sutherland and Paul Rubin's death scenes are so stupid. They are the worst death scenes ever seen. Like even this somewhat over the top stupidity is like meh, totally meh in comparison. Go check that out. It was, it was good. Come on in, kid. Okay. And are you liberating or thieving? We're selling the birds? Good work, Fernando. What did I tell you about this one? So you were going to pay him half as much as you said? Oh. No. Okay. So you're planning on selling the birds. But he reminds me of myself when I was that age. Here you go, kid. Sure, buddy. This is only half of what you promised me. Ah, shut up, kid. Motherfucker. What the? I needed these birds alive. This look alive to you? Yes. Ah. Ah. <laughs> Sucker. <Ooh>. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, rough. Okay. What's the matter? Cockatoo <laughs> got your throat. No. Yes, exactly. Nigel. Alive. To be continued. I was wondering where Jermaine Clement was going to be, or who he was going to be, I suppose. That was your plan, to take off and leave me. Why didn't you follow me? The last blue macaws on Earth. These are worth a fortune. I wonder what a fortune is. I suppose it doesn't matter. It's all relative, right? Fuck. Uh, it makes sense. Hey, birdie. That's... Let me out. Let oh. me out. Oh, my God. I'm a pretty bird. Pretty bird. I'm a pretty bird. <laughs> they got the wrong guy. <laughs> okay. I like the bat thing. That, that was funny. Sorry, guys. So, what's going to happen to them? We're going to find good homes for them. Now, go home to your mama. But I don't have a mama. Brother? Goldfish? He is an orphan. Aw, can uh. we keep him, boss? No. Rough. What's really going to happen to those birds? Who cares? We're going to be rich. <laughs> oh, that's good for you, but Fernando is living in the slums. Apparently without a family. <laughs> Which is... Uh, oh, so brutal. I really had to get real with this one, huh? Is this where he's been living? That's worse than Aladdin's place. Tomorrow or the deal is off. Of course I have both the macaws. I wonder how much money he's getting for these two birds. First thing in the morning, we bring those birds to the airport. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, uh, sure. yeah. Heard huh? you. Oh. I don't feel like they got it. Feed Nigel. <laughs> <laughs> that is hilarious. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Scissors cuts rock. Fucking what? How come you always win? Because he just lies to you and you believe it. That's why. Nice birdie. Here you go. <laughs> What are you feeding it? Is it chicken wing? <sighs> hmm. Bro, oh, oh, chicken drumstick. Any minute now, Linda will find us. Oh, great. Then she'll stick us behind another set of bars. Cages might work for you, but I don't want to belong to anyone. Completely fair. Something seems to be lodged in my beak. Would you mind? The fuck? Uh, oh, no. <laughs> um. God, that's terrifying. <laughs> Oh, I know I'm not a pretty birdie, but I used to be quite the star. What happens? Lights, camera, action. 
<laughs> Fly hard. I was striking suave, super delicious. Now I'm vile and malicious. <laughs> and they got a pretty parakeet to fill my shoe. That's why I am so evil. Sad. It's kind of weak, man. A South American idol. South American idol who doesn't sound South American at all. Very New Zealand sounding South American. Feathery freak with a beak, a bird murderer. I poop on people and I blame it on seagulls. <laughs> Well, at least you can get away with that. Seagulls, they're assholes. I'm unmincible. I'm unwashable. I'm sorry. Hang on. You, you can't be washed? I will make you ugly too. Ah, uh, okay. You just want everyone to share in your misery? Not cool, man. Scary, but not cool. It depends on what kind of cool you're going for. If you're going for super intimidating and creepy. Well, I guess that's not cooler, but whatever. No one is coming! Bro. And if we just sit here, we're going to die! Yeah, I'm pretty sure Linda is gonna try to come save you. Yes! No! Dude, are you shitting me? The game! And these guys don't care about their jobs anyway, so... Why don't you just open the door? What? It's just a standard flip slide bulb. Just rotate oh, 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 oh. <laughs> What are you doing? Oh, I can't... What? You can't what? He can't fly. <laughs> Oh man. I can't fly! Ooh. Is there anything else I need to know? I pick my beak, and once in a while I pee in the bird bath. Happy? No, not really. There they are! We gotta get out of here! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah, 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 wait, wait. That's one way to travel. Flying may not be my thing, but walking is. Yes, the game! Ruff, 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 ruff. Okay. I'm bilingual too. Oh. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. It'd be really useful for you guys right now. A skateboard. I'm changing to the only bird in the world who can't fly. There are about 40 species of flightless birds. Duck! Ducks can fly. No! Duck! <laughs> <laughs> oh man, hey. Get away from them terrifying claws, huh? <laughs> oh yeah, that's something. Roof surf on this fucking jagged piece of metal. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that's... Oh, what? The whole of Rio? <laughs> Get out of here, you putrid poultry. <laughs> putrid poultry, that's great. For real, man. If you just ran into whatever electrical transformer or power place that had enough... That, that was connected to the whole of Rio, and you're still alive? That's some bullshit. Okay. Hey, maybe he's got electric powers now. Ooh, ooh, what was that? A stick? Dude, I know you haven't been out at all, but you have, I guess, briefly been in an environment like this. Come on, we need to find a safe place to spend the night. Safe? We are in the jungle. You've never been to a jungle. How the fuck would you know? This is where our kind naturally lives. Don't talk to me about nature. I watch Animal Planet. <laughs> <laughs> you watch Animal Planet? Out here, I'm just an hors d'oeuvre. That is why we stay in the trees and not on the ground. Yeah. No, I don't think so. Nah. -uh. Gonna have to figure out this flying situation. I would feel much more comfortable in something man-made. How about up there? Yeah, I guess that's an option. I can't believe I have to drag your clumsy butt up there. Watch and learn. Blue! Oh, just wait! Hey, he's an epic climber, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Literally dragging her. You see, who needs flying? Birds. Flying is... Yeah, for real, dude. Flying would still be super useful. Freedom and, and not having to rely on anyone. Don't you want that? Yes. I don't know. In fact, that's one of the things I love most about the, some of the sports I grew up doing. If you consider them sports, but that's another debate we'll get into at another time. Bodyboarding, surfing, skateboarding. One of the best things to do is get in the air and feel like you're flying, even if it's only for a few seconds. It's one of the great things about skating stair sets is the extra time in the air. Even if the impact is hard and, you know, if you bail, <laughs> obviously that can hurt. But yeah, freedom, man. That's what's up. Sounds a little lonely. Let's get some sleep. Uh, probably gonna be up for a little while. He's way too anxious. I'm still on Minnesota time. Oh, right. Because of the Minnesota time, of course. Good night, Joel. Good night, Linda. Yeah, I imagine Linda might not be sleeping either. Sir, have you seen my bird? Oh, oh man. Trying to get people to identify your bird here? That's a tough one. Yeah. 
Put them everywhere, I guess. For real though, that would be a super difficult task. <laughs> okay. The flyering worked, kind of. American lady, I know where your birds are. You found blue? Uh, found is not the right word. <gasps> it's his! Let me see that. Dude, what the fuck? Ooh. Oh god, no! Why are you so weird, man? You're right. Okay, I'll take you to him. We don't know this boy. We can't trust him. Also, you want to get some aloe vera for that sunburn? I have to trust him. I don't have a choice. You're way too pale to be in this kind of sun all the time. <laughs> With the blue hands and everything. How could you lose them? They outsmarted us, boss. Dude, why would you admit to being outsmarted? Right to the two birds. Get the birds to the airport tonight. But it's Carnival. That's why I wanted to go this morning. It's 10 times smarter than the two of you combined. It does seem that way. Yeah. Then why don't you put him in charge? I am putting He's him in charge. Too. Okay. <laughs> go find him, Nigel. The bird's definitely way more terrifying than those two dolts. If we can't get through the parade, we'll have to be in the parade. Yeah. What, is she gonna make a float? Are you sure this is gonna work? Check out my map. The fuck? Yeah, that's, that's, let's just get this chain broken. Oh, to break the chain. Then we can go and find Linda. You can go find Linda. I'm gonna go back to being free yeah. in the jungle. Fair enough. Good deal. Oh, oh shit. Oh, dude. Oh. Ah! That was probably a good thing that that happened. I'm pretty sure that rock was too big. I think something's watching us. <laughs> <laughs> ah, toucans. Are they baby toucans? Oh, be careful, Blue. Yes. They might snuggle you to death. <laughs> oh, come here. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Uh, yeah, that seems about right. <laughs> <laughs> Being terrorized by children. What a universal experience. Attack! Um, attack. Why? What's going on down there? <laughs> oh, for fun. Right. Kiss kids, of course. Oh, precious, aren't they? Um, at times. 17 of them, and one on the way. Not a maraca, stop shaking them! The eggs? Yeah, definitely don't shake the eggs. You two lovebirds headed for carnival? Lovebirds? Uh, we're more like acquaintance birds. And not even. <laughs> They're just regular birds, or rare birds, but whatever. Do you think you could help us get this off? <laughs> you know Raphael, and Raphael knows everyone. I'm guessing you're Raphael. Okay, you want me to call your mother? <laughs> They're scared to death of her. <laughs> Call me for what? Oh. Uh, okay, so you're also scared to death of her. Cool. I must take this young couple to see Louise. You and your amigo just want to sneak off to Carnival. I'm confused. Hang on a second. That magical time when I met the most beautiful bird in the world. Yes, that's the exact time, buddy. Do female toucans look like that? With the green beak and the green eyes and stuff? Never come across that. I mean, don't get me wrong, if they're just doing a thing for artistic expression, I guess that's cool. Interesting at the very least, but yeah. Someone tell me, is this a thing? Remember the song that was playing when I first laid eyes on you? Ah, uh, good work, buddy. The girl from Ipanema. And what's your fantasy? Oh, oh, gee, no. Like a river of the sweetest honey. I guess love is deaf, too. Yes, love is deaf, apparently. Love is selectively tone deaf. Take them to Louise. Hurry back. You are an angel. I feel like angels could sing really well. Can't believe she actually let me go. How far is this Louise? Let you go. God damn, dude. 30 minutes says the crow flies. How long as the macaw walks? Bobo here can't fly. Yeah, he's... I want to help, but to walk the whole way, it, it can't be done. He's dying. No, no, no. He's dying. Obviously, it could be done. It's going to take some time. We might as well give it a shot. Let's go. Don't look back. They sense fear. Fair enough. But Thrill, is it not time to try to, like, make him fly? Because that would be, like, really useful. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> Uh, little thief monkeys. Fuck yeah. Oh, goddamn, dude. You got through that quick. Adorable monkey! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn. What do you guys do with all this stuff? You sell it? Or do you just like shiny things? Hey, my watch! <laughs> you just like shiny things. 
Okay. Hello, boys. Seems like you've had a busy day. <laughs> this is just some stuff we <laughs> found. Just an average day at work. There are two blue macaws out there. Help me find them. What's in it for us? Food? <laughs> oh, intimidation. What could I possibly do for you in return? Oh, save me! Oh, but is it enough? I don't want to feel like I'm cheating you. Save me! Sure. So, extortion, I guess. All right, you've twisted my wing. Deal. Any more questions? No? I saw the, the see no evil, hear no evil monkeys. Funnily enough, the, the hear no evil, see no evil, speak no evil monkeys is the inspiration for the Megadeth logo, or mascot, I should say. <laughs> this guy on my shoulder right here. He's got the, the metal on his eyes, his ears, and his mouth. It's like a play on the see no evil, hear no evil thing. And all of these words are describing how he ended up in this way. But yeah, I thought it was a fun little tidbit of information. Find these macaws by the end of the day. Or it's flying lessons for everyone. Yeah, they can get flying lessons, but Blue can't? What the hell? Obviously, I know he was fucking around there. Intimidation and all that. <laughs> Uh, maybe we can find a, a bus schedule or something. Come on. Okay, so this is how we're going to teach him how to fly? Not in front of the lady. Yeah, yeah, sure. All right, you sure you're up for this? Yeah. No, this doesn't seem like a great idea. It's not like we're just hurling ourselves off a mountain or something. No, that's, that's the plan. Don't worry, Blue, it's in your DNA. If our featherless friends can do it, how hard can it be? Ah! Ooh, yeah. <laughs> Dude, secure your money before you go. I need you two to get closer. Closer? Why? How is that supposed to help? I'll put your wings around each other. What? What? It's not like she's gonna bite. Okay, for real though, how is this gonna help the flying? You flap your right wing, you flap your left wing, and together. Oh, teamwork style. But this doesn't seem aerodynamically possible. Yeah. Flying is not what you think up here, what you feel in here. When you feel the rhythm of your heart, it's like samba. Okay, I hate that description. <laughs> Fuck you, dumb bird, uh, Raphael. Say it's easy. No, it's not. That's not how learning stuff works. Terrible teaching. From here, it looks really, really hard. If you want to see Linda again, this is the only way. No, you're supposed to do it out of a tree first. Let's whoa, go. Whoa, wait. Inside, outside. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. Uh, yeah. Not again. <laughs> yeah. Could have seen this one coming. <laughs> terrible, terrible plan, guys. Am I dead? No. We're still alive. You're very lucky to be catching this flight. Okay, so yeah, this is how you get your taste for flying. This is the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. <laughs> See what you've been missing? Yeah. Uh, mostly. He still needs to actually fly. All right, Blue, you're flying. Sort of. Mm, yeah, sort of. I do feel it. Hey, spread your wings. See if you can catch some air. Yeah, there you go. I mean, you're on top of this glider. See if you can practice getting your wings out there. No, no, Blue, oh, no. You'd probably maybe talk to her first. If you did that shit at the same time, it might have worked. Might have worked out. Ah! We're gonna die. Okay. Good news is just the beach. You probably land on an umbrella or something. There's a fuckload of umbrellas on this beach. Whatever. You did not feel it in here. <sighs> yeah, that was the issue. Let's catch a ride to Luis. Pretty sure he was trying to feel it in here. Vamos, um, vamos. Aha, last of the species here. Guys, please just go quicker. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> you made it. Well, she made it. He got dragged here, kind of. Starting to close off the streets for Carnival. Better be right, kid, because we're running out of time. Uh, he's not wrong. Well, I mean, I guess he's kind of technically wrong now that the birds are no longer there. <sighs> Never be able to get my car through this crowd. Amani. Shit, where'd you guys get the bike? I traded it for your Jeep. What? Ah, how did he trade your Jeep without you knowing? <laughs> Gotta love the markets. Well, at least, at least I used to. Markets in Sydney these days are so expensive, they're not worth going to. Final Louise, we're right where we want to be. If it isn't the king of Carnival, Nico, Pedro, what up, family? Oh, 
Nico is apparently still rolling with this bottle cap for a hat. Ain't that the bird from the cage? I think our love lessons went down smooth. Now you rolling with a hot wing? I want to be like you. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Guys, just shut up. Also, how the fuck does Pedro fly? <laughs> Tiny wings to his body. You know, size comparison style. We're looking for Luis. Have you seen him? Yeah. He took the trolley back to the garage. You could catch the next one. We, oh. we gotta get this chain off. Come first. on, okay. lovebirds, you're in Rio. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Blue is right about the chain. Deal with the chain. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking all right. We got him. Huh. Well, I'm this is super convenient that you guys stole and learn how to use these phones. It's a party, huh? This is the coolest place I've ever seen. You have not seen a lot of places, but I guess you. Rafi has some special guests from out of town. Let's show them some love. Well, hang on. Isn't only one of them from out of town? Party in Ipanema, baby. Oh, we're going back to that same song. Is that what's up? I want to party and fly. So let me fly just like a rocket then. Okay. <sighs> you know, the only thing I've got to say so far is I could hear the auto-tune. You're not supposed to hear the auto-tune. Okay. Like, if you can hear the auto-tune in your vocal takes, you need to just redo the vocals. You know, don't get me wrong, use a little auto-tune, but you're not supposed to notice it. God damn. What are you doing? Uh, I don't know. And fly. Blast up, blast up, blast up. You dance fast, but I hey, dance fast. Hey, she likes fast, you. Fast, okay, this guy is just rapping the same word over and over again. It's really annoying. You just be yourself. Go on. Party. I want a song. Party. I want a party. And fly. <laughs> that vibrato is not nice. Sorry, I know I'm just ripping this song. I... I guess I don't like it. Hey. Ah. Oh, yeah, we can hear it on her too. Could they have just re-recorded the vocals? Party's over. <laughs> hey, buds, you all know you can fly, right? I guess except blue. You two are coming with me. <laughs> Fucking why? In your little monkey dreams. Nice. Oh, dude. Oh, oh, no, buddy. Can we all just get along? You mess with my friends, you mess with me. It shouldn't be a fight at all. These are all birds. Why are you guys just standing here? Fly away. The monkeys can't fly. I don't know what's going on here. Well, that one monkey is trying to set the tension. Birds versus monkey! <laughs> This fight is confusingly pointless. We gotta go! Not even a good fight. These monkeys are fucking useless. Why were you guys all so scared? <laughs> <laughs> nice. The bottle cap finally came in handy. If that's your thought process for the bottle cap, to use it like a frisbee, like that um that one Mortal Kombat character, was it Kung Lao? <laughs> Fuck yeah. Thank you! Anytime! Follow me. Uh... I mean, they've been following you. But uh, the birds were here. Oh, Devo. Well, how do you know? Be because. Yeah, just tell them. I'm the one who took them. You? I, I, I just, I needed the money. Yeah, no shit. I trusted you. I know, but. Oh my God. But Lily, Fernando is a fucking homeless child. <laughs> don't, don't act like that, man. Oy. Just be glad that he uh, cared enough to try to help you and then tell you the truth and then maybe give him some fucking money. God damn. <laughs> oh man, that's good. Hey guys. Hey. I just wanted to see if you had any work for me. Yeah, perfectly reasonable. You could have helped us load the- Ow! What? Shut up. Yeah, that's fair. Why are you guys dressed for carnival? No one will notice us when we smuggle these- Ow! Oh my God, what's wrong with you? Can't you just say because we want to go to carnival? We made a float. Oh, so you guys are going to the parade. Can I come? Can he come? Come on, please. Three's better than two. No. Fine. We gotta hurry, though. Well, you always gotta have the one super dumb guy to ruin your plans, right? I thought it was right here. There it is. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> sure. Can he ride on the plane with us, too? Ow! We can't let <laughs> them get on that plane. Good luck, Fernando. You can drive a motorcycle, right? You insult me. Good enough? 
I suppose. Oh, no. Not good enough. No, I can't drive a motorcycle. Could you have admitted that beforehand? Like, maybe she can? Oh, yeah, she can. Yeah. Seriously, my dude. If you can't ride the bike, just ask the other person if they can. God damn it. Ah. Oh, my God. This sad fight scene. Papa? What happened? We weren't at all prepared to take on the birds. Oh, bud, you hid this whole time? No. Where are the cerulean birds? They escaped, went to Louise. They said you were very nice. Hmm, did they? Hmm, no, they didn't. Liar. Never send a monkey to do a bird's job. Hmm. That seems like a nice tram ride. I got it. Do you? <laughs> the subtle edge closer. Uh, you're gonna do the yawn and oh, yeah, no yawn, but is it hot? I, I think I'm, I'm sweating. <laughs> Bro, you know the old. <sighs> right. Okay, so he needs a little help. Oh, come on, let's give him some. He needs a lot of help, but I don't think any of you guys are useful. Check it out. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, girl. Take it, take it to the flow. Oh my god. I'm pretty sure for most people, having someone do this in the background would make it super weird. Not hating on your creativity, but I think I got this one. Yeah, even that. Literally, just having like your friend in the background singing music to make it more romantic makes it weird and uncomfortable. That's more like it. Oh, I love those trees though. Are those cherry blossoms? Wasn't really thinking, wasn't looking for an answer when I saw your face. Have you guys ever had a friend try to like force a romance to happen with you and someone else, regardless of whether there was chemistry or not? I feel like it's worse. Like when you don't have chemistry, it's obviously awkward. But when you do have chemistry and someone else is trying to make it happen for you, it's just like, um, can you fucking stop? Just tell her you have beautiful eyes. I have beautiful eyes. Uh, her eyes. Oh, my God, your eyes. Yeah, 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 yeah. You don't, you don't know what you're doing. I get it. Just tell her how you feel. Does he know how he feels? I've been wanting to tell you that I... <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're choking! Uh, okay, all right. Yep, he is choking. On a flower petal. You can't just swallow that? One more time! <laughs> yep, that's my boy. It is. But hey, look, he's had very little experience hanging out with other birds no social skills or life at all been living at home with linda for literally ever i give you luis's garage i guess this is it uh, yeah guess things like this don't happen in tiny soda <laughs> tiny soda oh my god i never thought of that minnesota mini soda that's great i got some friends i want you to meet um is this the friend <laughs> ew Oh no, 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 no. I got you good. Yeah, we're still afraid of the drool, man. Stop scaring my friends. Hey, Ralphie. Oh my God, could someone clean his mouth? Luis is a bulldog. That's something against dogs. When they're drooling on me. Yes, that. It's a medical condition. So much drool. Why did the animators do this? I think I know what to do. You gonna spit on it? Oh shit, <laughs> that's one way to do it. Are you sure this is safe? There's nothing to it. I don't think he cares if it's safe. Something goes wrong, scream really loud. I can't hear too good with this thing on. That makes sense. He's a professional. He makes money doing this? People pay him for this? Because that's what professional means. Now try not to move. Can't really see out of this thing either. Oh. 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 Speaking of which, before we get into this, I really feel like there's this wide misconception of what professional is. I mean, don't get me wrong, there's, you can behave with professionalism, but to be a professional in something, you have to make at least most of your income from that thing. Like, I'm a professional YouTuber because all of my money is made from YouTube. But there are areas out there where you can be considered a professional for entirely different reasons. Like, in skateboarding, I know... You're a pro if you have your name on a board. It doesn't matter how much money you make, which is stupid to me. You know what I mean? Not that that's the same thing here. 
or that we should be getting into this <laughs> all that much. <laughs> you guys did good. This is perfect. Whew. I only lost one. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. Oh, God. Yeah, I was going to say, can you guys let go of that sooner rather than later? <laughs> hey, so what I was saying earlier about the speed did work. Ugh. Yep, and that got caught up in that. That makes sense. Yeah. Joel, we're free. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. It's carnival! Yay, now everyone fly away, except for Blue, because he can't. Anyone? No? No one's gonna notice? Or remember? I know just how you feel. Almost. It makes you want to chase them and grab them in your mouth and <laughs> bite their heads off, huh? Yeah, that's not it. That's definitely not what he's feeling. <laughs> ah, there it is. Where are you going? What do you mean, where is he going? You gotta recognize how this must be really sad for him. I mean, I know he's been saying this whole time about how, like, he's perfectly fine walking. He doesn't want to fly and all that kind of stuff. But he's obviously just afraid of it. And then you had that experience with him where you saw that, yeah, he might actually really enjoy flying because obviously. Don't get me wrong. I'm, I, I don't blame you for immediately wanting to fly and be like so stoked about that. But, you know, get back to the whole disappointed sad bird that you're kind of connecting with, you know, just a little bit sooner. Unless, of course, you're, you don't care and you just you know, want to part ways now and in which case, you know, you do you. Blue, what's wrong? What do you mean, what's wrong? Everything's perfect. You'll be off to the rainforest. I'll be back with Linda. Stop yapping and start flapping! Seriously, you guys are so dumb. I guess I thought maybe... What, that you'd come to Minnesota? Great, I, I guess I'll knit you a scarf. <laughs> she definitely doesn't want to go to Minnesota. I can't spend my life walking around following you. It's not my fault you can't fly. No. It's not. But this is obviously what he's sad about. He can't fly. He can't really be with you. He's not good enough. There's like a multitude of things here. I don't belong here. I never wanted to come here in the first place. There you go. I hate samba. <gasps> sure. Every song sounds exactly the same. Tico, taco, ya, ya, ya. Okay. <laughs> disagree with the tico, taco, ya, ya, ya thing. But yes, samba does all sound a little bit the same, but that's because samba is based on a specific beat where if you play a different beat, it's not samba anymore. And that's fine. It's dance music. And whether you do or don't like it shouldn't matter. <laughs> but yeah, I guess we're going to make a whole point out of it. Sure. I'm Tico Taco out of here. See you around, pet. No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Come back. Uh, this didn't seem like enough of a conflict for you guys to be uh, all flying off angrily like this. Blue, come back here. I'm ready for carnival. Man, you... Fruit. You put some effort into that thing. Fuck yeah. You left without me. That's messed up. Jules! Jules! Wait up! Seriously, how does that motherfucker fly? There's no way those wings can hold him up. <laughs> Going somewhere, pretty bird. Ah, uh, yeah. I was just on my way to claw your eyes out! Yeah. Nice. Fight. Come along, my dear. We're going to a parade. <laughs> Let go of me! Okay, so... He's just too strong. That sucks. Ain't nobody messing with a friend of Pedro. It's on! Pedro, what do you mean it's on? You're barely staying in the air. Quit following me. Isn't Carnival mm. that way? No, I'm going home. But I thought you loved Carnival. He does. And his wife is going to be angry. But I love my family much more. It's a choice I made with this, not with this. I was flying and then I saw this big yeah, cockatoo. Yeah. And he snatched Jewel up like he snatched him up. Hey guys, could you just say... Jewel was taken by a big bird. And he's taking it to the parade! This is all my fault. No. No, it's not. I guess you were involved. It's definitely not all your fault, though. Let's fly. You will get wet on this ride! <laughs> Don't travel behind that dog <laughs> for any reason. You're a little bird. You can fly to the side or above or in front, but not behind because of the drool. You know, that's just to be clear. Where are these guys? God damn. No way your guys built that thing. Very nice. They didn't. They didn't. That's someone else's float. That makes way more sense. That is absolute trash. How are you so hyped about this goddamn float, man? Um, coming through. 
You know, at this point, you'd probably be better off just walking the bike through the crowd. Wait, stop. Performance only. Okay, which performers are you guys going to be? Oh, of the bird kind. That makes sense. Yeah. <gasps> You're so happy to finally kind of look like a bird. <laughs> You don't have to be so much like a bird that you actually like run into the fucking mirror. Tulio? Oh, I was just. Uh... Oh God. Yeah, don't get me wrong. She looks great in her bird costume or whatever, but like. I look ridiculous, don't I? Yeah, you both do. You're more into her now that she looks like a bird or she's dressed as a bird. Come on, man. That's the way it should be. <laughs> yeah, that's better. I, I prefer that outcome. The parade, it's about to start. What I'd really prefer, she ditched the bird costume and then you were like, oh wow, now that's attractive. Naturally. <laughs> Bruh, I'm pretty sure you didn't have to act like that. Blue. Yeah, Vombata. Wait, 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 no, no, no. Looking for a bluebird. Birdo, no, yes. Yeah. Vombata, Vombata, Vombata. Oh. If you're not trying to be in the performance, then maybe get rid of the costume as soon as you get it. At least the head part, you could rip off the wings. But yeah, of course he thinks you're in the performance. <laughs> Ew, oh God. <laughs> you know what, buddy, you deserve that. Stop acting like a weird fucking thug. Tulia! This is not good, this is not good. I mean, it's not necessarily bad, it's just not exactly. And sprinkles. A useful place for you to be. Ooh, centerpiece of the float. Oh, that's brutal. <laughs> yeah. No, fair. You guys put together a absolute garbage thing. One down and one to go. You'll never find him. He's already gone. Gone where? He'll find you. Hey, hang on. Why do you think he'll find you? He, he's not very competent. I mean, I know he's getting it together, and obviously he will, but why do you think that? Yeah, baby! Now I can get my freak on! Rescue first, freak later. Huh? Yes. I mean, Blue's got his head in the game. I'll fly ahead and look for Jewel! Yeah, good plan. Reconnaissance. Paula, Paula. What? Paula. Yeah, no idea what that means. Obviously, Linda, just try to get down from there. Linda! I mean, I, okay, I know they're gonna do the thing where she has to find her confidence and dance and she's probably gonna feel great about it. You gotta shake your but for real, We don't shake our tushies in Minnesota! Oh. Yeah, no, I'm pretty sure some people like to dance and shake their tushies in Minnesota. But for real, Linda, if you're searching for your bird, you're desperate to like, yeah, I guess that's one way. Get off the fucking float. <gasps> Good, okay, you're getting down from the float. I'm so glad that you're not just gonna fucking dance. Oh. Ooh, nice, that worked. Oh. Oh. Linda? Wait. Yeah, you know what, I don't mind it kind of looking like a performance as she's trying desperately to get down from here and get to you. Let's go get you. Where are you going? Even if she's kind of failing, like, you know you can get off these guys, right? Oh. Get off the float. Stop trying to dance. Just bail. What the fuck? Are you trying to save him or not? What the hell? Blue! I saw Blue. He's riding on a bulldog. Yeah, Blue. I saw him and then he ran away while I was dancing. There they are. That's the float. Woo! Whoa! Oh, damn. <laughs> Fair enough. What the fuck is up with these skateboards? Why are they square? There he is! Okay, by the way, I meant rectangle, not square. You, you know what I mean. Jewel. Blue. Squared off. I'm gonna get you out of here. Blue, you can't be here. Nigel is here. <laughs> kind of you to join our little soiree. It was really kind of him. I got three of the roughest, craziest birds in all of Rio right behind me. Seriously? Dude. You know that, guys? We're saved! Ah, <laughs> <sighs> oh, love. It's such a powerful and stupid thing. Yes! Well done, Nigel. Fucking nice. Yeah, you guys are a good team. Probably ditch the other two dudes, though. They're not useful. Sorry. Oh, wait, wait. 
Yeah, I feel kind of bad trying to run through that crowd of stilt walkers. Can we do this again next year? Can I drive next year too? Uh-huh. Leaving a trail. Fernando. Get in. What? No? That seems like a terrible idea. Linda, uh, you know what? I was going to say you'd be better off getting the skateboards to try to follow them. Then I realized probably never ridden one. I can't learn how to do that out of nowhere. So fair enough. Stealing a giant flute. Couldn't have stolen a car? Maybe there were no cars around. I'm going to get you guys out of here. You shouldn't have done that. Oh, come on. Not well thought out. At least Fernando has an excuse, though. He's like a 10-year-old. Yeah. Just forget yeah. it. They're getting away. I guess plus side of the float, it should be big enough to stop a plane if you can get in front of it. We did it, boys. Yes. Mm, almost. A float? Yeah, it is. Pull up, you idiot. Pull up. Ah! Yeah, just in time. Sure. Yeah, that is sad though. I mean, I don't have a pet, but I know if I was in this situation and that was my pet, I'd be pretty heartbroken too. I'm gonna pop this cage open like a soda can. <laughs> okay, yeah. His lifetime is spent dealing with cages. He knows how to prison break. Hurry, we gotta help the others. Okay, she's, yeah. Is she ever gonna recover from the pretty bird thing? I'm out! <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, those birds stuffed into a cage. The little ones, they just be stuffed in there for like days or whatever. God damn. Ha, ah, sucker. For real though, guys, you know it's open. You can fly out now. You don't have to wait for it to like be fully open. You could just, you could be gone already. Go, go, go. Thank you, please. Dude, you need to take a leap of faith right here. I get it, you're scared, but... Hey, it's okay. We'll figure this out together. Yeah, you're gonna have to figure it out. You're low on options. Because, <laughs> yeah, you might learn how to fly if you leave, but if you stay here, pretty sure Nigel's gonna fuck you up. Now we have two useless yep. flightless birds. Well, not useless, but, you know. Ooh. Oh no. Oh. Oh damn. Interesting. Oh. Well that did Oh no. Oh. So we went with Nigel got fucked up. He he's dead. He's all dead. Okay. We're going down! Okay, okay, rock, rock paper, paper, scissors, scissors shoot! Hasta la vista, losers! <laughs> that is pretty funny. Oh, get it, Mom! You just straight ju oh, I don't know. That is a long distance, guys. I'm pretty sure when you hit that water, it's going to kill you. Like you're falling through the clouds into the ocean. That's going to kill you. No! Ah! Oh, you know, I've forgotten about this whole falling out of the tree thing. Still does an excuse, you know, Linda for not trying to help him learn how to fly. But I can understand why he never got there. Didn't know how to deal with the trauma. Blue! I'm not going to let you go. We're chained to each other birds, remember? Aw, that's cute. Now you guys gonna splash down in the water? Oh, you're gonna fly. Cool. Spread your wings. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Blue. Oh, and you're helping her. Fuck yeah, dude. I'm really flying. You're right. I'm not an ostrich. <laughs> <laughs> you were never an ostrich, let's be real. Ostriches are fully capable of their own stuff. Obviously not flying, but... They've got their thing, which is running and hurting people. Okay. Idiots. Well, no, they were smart enough to grab onto you. Linda. It's blue. Look, Julio, it's blue. My blue is flying. Yay. And he's coming back. And you guys didn't really help in the saving. But that's cool. I'm glad that he, uh, you know, went through this journey. <gasps> Here, let me see. Yeah, he might be a fucking weirdo, but at least he understands bird anatomy, right? Don't worry. I'll take care of you. Cool. Nice. 
getting back to her life. That's really nice. Okay, so what's up? Linda, are you moving to Rio to stay here so that you can like still be a part of his life or are you guys parting ways now? That's my big brave boy. Pretty sure there's a sequel to this, right? So they, they must, something? I'm gonna say she stays here in Rio and they get to visit. And I guess she'll probably end up with Tulio or whatever. Julio? I can't even remember. Loving my life in the jungle. Never alone, cause this is our home. Oh shit. They had kids. That's cool. So we got a little bit of time time jump for this outro song. Oh, that was Will I Am. Everybody loves Samba. Feel in your heart. I'm the Samba Master. So is the next movie also in Rio? Or are they gonna go on like a different adventure? Yeah, okay. So Linda stayed. Pretty intense moving your whole life for your pet, but go hard, Linda. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> that is pretty funny. Okay, so that was Rio. I had fun with it. I did. Don't get me wrong, I know there's a lot of uh, silly moments and I tend to criticize things a lot, but that doesn't mean I didn't enjoy it. I think that was great. Um, looking forward to getting to the sequel, if that's at all possible. As you guys know, we do need videos to do at least somewhat well if we're going to be able to do the sequel. So Maze Runner did do the job. Steph and I will get to Scorch Trials um, pretty soon, hopefully. And if you want to see me, just me cover the second Rio as well. Leave your likes and comments and uh, hopefully we can get this video to 50,000 views. If we can hit 50k, and this is why I say 5k likes because you're going to have 50,000 views if you have 5k likes, usually. It's about that, you know what I mean? I, I enjoyed this movie. Uh, I like the cast. I like the storyline. It's all pretty simple, don't get me wrong. It's not like a masterpiece of a movie, but it's fun. Hopefully we can get to that. And uh, until then, you've been with... Just me, Sam, and I am your movie bud.